Now this illustration deals with disconnecting means for an air conditioner in accordance with 440.14. Now notice the overcurrent protection device ahead of that branch circuit could be sized at 175% all the way up to 225% of the full load amps uh, are current. And uh, that's 240.22A, uh, 240.4G, which lists in the table 240.4G that an air conditioner can have the overcurrent device size greater than 125% of the conductors and the load, see? And we know 240.6A selects the overcurrent device. Now the calculations you would have to apply and do if the uh, nameplate didn't call for a certain size circuit with a maximum size overcurrent device, circuit breaker, or fuse. Sometimes, you know, it'd be a hacker breaker, uh, heating, air conditioning, cooling, refrigeration type breaker. Might be time to lay fuses, and you'd have to have a fusible disconnect. So these are the things that the electrician uh, needs to review. Now let's review the uh, quick count like we're calculating everything. And 440.32 and 440.33, we would take 58 amps times 125% plus 100% of that condenser motor at 2.5 and we, we'd come up with 71 amps. Selecting now uh, the conductors from table 310.16, 71 amps requires a number four conductor. Now, uh, 440.22 says if you wanted to use the maximum setting, because this unit is on the roof or it's on the side of the building where the sun's on it all morning to solar noon and all the evening long till it sets, you might, it might be kicked up at 225%. Uh, times 55 amps, the compressor rating, uh, times 2.5 for the condenser motor, and you'd add up to 126 amps so that uh, uh, you can't go beyond that. You can't exceed the 225%. So this is a round down size in accordance with uh, uh, 440.22. Uh, so we would round down from 126 to 125 amp main, but notice the conductors would be number four. You wouldn't increase the size of the conductors with sizing the main or you couldn't terminate them. They'd be too large for the lugs uh, or the terminals at, at your contactor inside your, uh, your AC unit. So this deals with sizing the conductors and the overcurrent device based upon the maximum size. But you never go maximum as long as 175% or less percentage would work. As you see in the call-out information to the left of the uh, uh, service panel uh, dealing with the overcurrent device. But again, 440.4 uh, now. I believe it's C part says if the branch circuit selection current is listed on the nameplate, you got to use it. So what does that mean? It's going to tell you what size fuse max or circuit breaker max. You can always go below. And the size of the minimum size conductors that would supply the unit. But just remember this as an electrician. You cannot size the overcurrent device greater than 125% of the conductors and the equipment without your particular piece of equipment falls within table 240.4G. And your conductor percentages that you select, you'll be referred to the particular type of equipment from two, table 210.3 and table 220.3. I hope this information now helps when you're sizing conductors, overcurrent device, and locating the disconnecting means for an AC unit in accordance with 440.14.